All right, let's get this recording show on the. Uh. <coughs> what the fuck <coughs> just happened? Good day, everybody. It's me, Chero, and today we're going to be playing a little bit of Boneworks VR, where somehow in the first couple of seconds of recording, I managed to glitch out of the box that you meant to start in, fall out of the sky, and then land directly on top of it. So I guess this is where I punch in my real-life height. Uh, I'm actually a really, really big gentleman, so hopefully this game is capable of catering to my absolute ginormous brilliance. All right, seven foot, seven foot ten, eight, eight foot. Yeah, and I'm already starting to regret setting my height as eight feet tall because every single thing that I look at makes me feel like an absolute dwarf. Hold on a second. Shouldn't that be the complete opposite? <laughs> I'm going to be very disappointed if these giant hands aren't capable of hurling a chair across the room. Oh, okay. I'm a giant pussy. I don't know what the world's got in store for me, but there are two things that I need. A crowbar and this sex toy. Actually, no, f*** that. This dumbbell. Uh, actually, no, f*** that. The whole shelf. Apologies for the temporary terminal lockdown. What now? You can still remain productive even without a virtual terminal. I have a feeling that probably wasn't what I was supposed to do. All right, I think I'm gonna go with sandbox mode. Way to ruin the momentum, bro. All right, how about arena? Oh, fuck off. All right then, story mode it is. Well, it's my first day in the laboratory. I hope I make a good impression. Hi guys, I'm here for the slumber party. Oh, oh, have I have I walked into the middle of something? <laughs> no pun intended. God, these legs look awfully familiar. Where have I seen these things before? Hold on, don't tell me. Don't tell. Uh, oh, hold on a second. I know. Jesus Christ. Staff only. I'm I'm pretty sure I work here. I mean, I'm not I'm not entire God damn it, I'm not Frank. I'm not Shit, what's with this door? Stay open. Oh, particle waste. <laughs> My favorite. How did you know? Just gonna close the door behind me. <laughs> I mean if I if I could close the uh Frank this door. VR legs override. Oh, there's a hammer here for my pleasure, I'm assuming. Alright, let's uh let's override these VR legs. Oh shit! Hold on a second, didn't this say VR legs over- these- these are VR arms. Hey guys, you could probably use these more than I could, it'll save you a trip to the second hand store. <laughs> Here. Indie music, my only weakness. How did you know? There's gotta be a way to fit this inside of the trash can, come on. Come on, get- get in there. Get- get in the- okay. That's where you belong. I'm pretty sure that if you ever decide to eat pizza from Pizza Demon, it'll be the last pizza that you ever eat. You know, ever since I entered this virtual world, I felt like something was a little bit off. I couldn't quite put my finger on it, but I think I finally identified what it is. I have no reflection. As a matter of fact, <laughs> neither does the drink machine, neither does the table, neither does the trash- actually, nothing- Alright, so maybe I'm not the vampire, maybe the TV is the vampire. Oh. Yeah, this is definitely a vampire television set. What are these cute little aliens rolling around on the floor? Hey, buddy. Hey, how you going, cute little freaking? Come here, piece of shit. I told you I'd get you, but see, your sacrifice isn't entirely going to waste. I'm using your dead body to paint the walls. So this is the locomotion section of the museum. God, you remember when people used to make VR games with teleportation? <laughs> Pathetic. Literally nobody would even think about doing that these days. So I could climb up that, or I could climb up those. Or I could just be a lazy bastard and just grab this rope and just flip them both off while I go up in style. Oh god, I never thought I'd be so happy to see a little bit of green grass and fresh air again. Uh well, it looks like I might have finally found what I've been looking for. The perfect opportunity for me to test out my two-finger death touch. Uh, is that normal? <laughs> Alright, let me give this thing a little one- Ooh. What the f- You know, I don't want to brag or anything, but back at high school, they used to call me Bullet Fist. Oh, praise Jesus, I'm finally being asked to destroy something. Oh my god, are my eyes deceiving me right now? A gun? I- I finally found a- <clears throat> Gun? Alright, give me someone to shoot in the face right- You know what? Oh! Oh boy, this is why Australians don't have guns. Step one, keep weapon pointed in a safe door. Jeez, I wish I read that before I shot myself in the head. All right, so it looks like I got a couple of toys to play with here. I've got a Glock 9mm. Actually, I've got multiple Glock 9mm. Better make sure I have enough ammunition for all of them. All right, I'm closing my eyes. One, two, three, this one. All right, I guess this is one that, God damn it. I guess this is the one that I'm gonna use. Oh, shit. 
Oh, Christ. Oops. So, sorry. I think I put a hole in your ceiling. You bring the drugs, SA. I'm loco. I'm freaking loco. El polo loco. All right, here we go. It's trick shot time. Shit. Let me try that again. Trick shot. God damn it. What's with me catching it like this? All right, third time's the charm. Here we go. Oh! All right, hold the phone, hold the phone. We, we need we need some props here. Uh, we need some props for a John Wick roleplay. Can we get something that looks like a dog? Hey, mate, just gonna borrow your head for a second. Come here. Come on. You're... Come. I, I need you. Just come. Oh, piece of shit. All right. This is, this is my dog. All right, Daisy the dog, you're right there just after the Russian guy killed you. And uh, this is me getting my revenge. No, they... They killed my dog. You took her from me. You... STOLE HER FROM ME! YOU KILLED HER FROM ME! Fuck. Yeah! Alright, if I'm not entirely mistaken, this is a heckler and koch... Koch? Cock? Heckler... Heckling cock? Say hello to my little... Friend. Very nice. I love how I just, I cock it like this. I cock it like a, like a true aristocrat. It's like, <laughs> like one of those idiots that holds their cup of tea like this. I cock my gun like, like this. <laughs> oh God, I need to shoot myself in the head immediately. Unacceptable. This is easily the most overpowered gun in modern warfare. A brilliant piece of, uh, of military weaponry. It's even perforated through here uh it makes you run faster it's even got a beautiful little reflex side on it look at this you talking to me are you talking to me get that look off your face bouncy also have a little bit of axe murderer training up my sleeve I was never too good at that one. Ha! Hey, uh, e, cool, great. Oh, f fuck! You, Mr. Basketball Head, have been sentenced to death for being a pussy boy. Any last words? No. Okay. Uh. <sighs> You're dead now. Hey, look at my massive dong. <laughs> Love this. This is great. Best exhibit in the entire museum. Let me slow time down a little bit to... Oh, Christ. What the... Oh. Ugh. What the hell is... Oh, God. What... Oh, oh shit. Ah, oh, finally. Somewhere I can put my feet up and relax a little bit. I'm glad that this place has a great variety in gifts and souvenirs that you can buy for your friends. You can buy the orange M&M. Or the orange M&M. Or maybe you want to buy the orange M or or maybe maybe you want to get something really different and get the orange M and M. Hold on, wait, what? Now now leaving the museum, but but I'm not I'm not ready to leave the museum yet. Look, let me just go through here and recycle. Oh, it doesn't mean recycle the stuff that you brought with you from the museum. It means actually do the recycling for the museum, because because nobody else is doing it. Can I recycle myself? Oh shit. Oh, oh! Alright, Bernie, you're coming with me, mate. I, uh, I think I might need myself a little bit of a tour guide. Can't say that I'm too familiar with these parts. Why am I doing this? Quarantine. Yeah, great. This can't be good. If anyone's hiding behind these boxes, you better come out with your- Oh shit! Ah! 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 What the f- Ah! 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 Oh! It's a peaceful alternate reality. No, get off my face. No, get get off. I don't want your peaceful alternate reality. Stupid little bitch spider. Get off my face. Son of a bitch. Thing is dead yet? All right, massive gas-powered cart-looking thing. Bunch of boxes on the edge of a building, uh, and a red button that I assume makes this thing go forward. All right, I guess I'm riding this train to the end of the line. <laughs> oh shit. Alright, I think I might have lost my balls about 50 meters back there. Oh shite. God. Hi. Look, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll give you a burger if you f*** off. Oh. Would have given you that burger if you had a f*** off. Coming for you, boy. I'm coming for you. Bruh. <laughs> Who needs a freaking gun when you've got an axe with a spiky thing on the end of it? Oh, it's a real- p Hey, what? Dude. Hey, pal, you're looking a little bit stuck there. You want, you want me to help you get out from here? Hold on a second, let me just- 
You just shoot that lock off. Come out, buddy. Come on, come on, come out. Must have been trapped in there for a long time. How huh? you're probably desperate for some, you know, human interaction and stuff. Let me give you some. Here's some human interaction. You like that? Look. That's human interaction from the ghetto, bitch. Well, I think on that note, that's enough bone works for one day. So if you liked the video as much as I did recording it, feel free to leave a like, comment down below, subscribe, turn on notifications, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching, and goodbye.